sure is a crappy day out, but I have some big news for you guys, so stay tuned for this video. It is raining and raining. Yesterday it rained all day, today it is raining all day. Today is even worse than yesterday. No, today is a crappy day, and it's raining, it's wet. The colors of fall look really cool. A lot of the red and oranges are really turning really bright. But this video um, is probably one of the most awaited videos I'm going to make this year. So I built a tiny house, right? You know, it's right here. I built it probably a year and a half ago, almost two years ago, I built this house. It's cool, people like it, I like it still, and it was really fun to do. But what's next? Am I just going to make videos about the same old house every week? Or am I going to change things up and build my second house? Now, if you guys have been watching my videos and seeing what I've been saying, I have been hinting about the second tiny house and when I'm going to make it and when I'm going to build it. In this video, I'm going to talk about the second tiny house a little bit more and give you guys a lot more information about it. But let's head inside because it's it's nasty out here. Okay, so now that we're inside, it's a little bit warmer. I have the heater going and it's not raining on me. Now that we're inside, we can talk a little bit more. So I've been thinking a lot about this subject for a long time. I've been preparing and planning, saving up money, and I've just been preparing a lot for the second build. I've been hinting to it a lot in these last few videos, but I haven't really known what my next steps are going to be to, you know, um, really take the next step into the project. Um, the time frame. That's what I first want to talk to you guys about is the time frame when I want to get this done. Now, I originally did say 16. But the way my birthday aligns, um, I turn, um, my birthday's in October, and I'm basically November. So October 29th is my birthday. So we're, it's kind of late in the year. So if I plan on doing it at 16, I'll be have to build it in the winter time. And I don't want to do that. I want to build it during the summertime. Um, so I was thinking maybe this upcoming summer would be a great summer to do it um, because I'll be 15 and um, then I won't have to worry about building it during the winter time because that just sucks. So I want to do it in the summertime, so maybe I'm planning on building it this upcoming summer. Now there's a lot of things to talk about with this build and I don't know how much I want to te uh, tell you guys yet because I don't know how much things are going to change. There's a lot of things that are going to happen. I made a, a checklist down here on my laptop that I'll, I'll be looking at, make sure I cover everything. Number one thing I want to do is collaborate with you guys. I want to work with you, I want to work with brands, I want to work with companies, I want to work with people. That's the number one thing. I don't want this to be just my build, I want to be able to um, bring you guys along and I want it to be your build as well. Um, if that's just you watching these videos, support me that way, that helps a lot. If you guys want to be a Patreon, that supports me as well. Or by leaving comments, you know, my videos about the next build, I'll have questions and I know I will have questions or I'll let you guys, I'll put a poll and you guys can um, decide what product I use or what kind of toilet I use or like any of that kind of stuff. So I want you guys to be involved in this build. I don't want just to be all my decisions. I want you guys to make decisions and you know help me with this build. That's my number one thing. I would not be making my next tiny house without you guys. That's the reason I'm making my next tiny house is because you guys are helping me and because you guys want to see the next build. I want this to be a very affordable tiny house, but I want it to be a tiny house I'll be living in for many years to come. So it's going to be on an 18 or 20 foot trailer. It's going to be on wheels and it's going to be a nice size tiny home. This tiny home, I you could live in it full time, but it is quite small. It only is five and a half feet wide and ten feet long. So that's including the loft is 89 square feet. That's not a lot of space. Um, this is smaller than most people's sheds. So um, I want it to be a lot bigger. Um, I want it to have all the full um, amenities that uh, normal homes have: showers, um, full um, kitchens, and just all the normal things that people have in their home. I want it to be in this tiny house. Kind of like what I said earlier, I want to document the entire process. Every step of the way, I want it to be on film. That way, I can look back on it when I'm older, and you guys can be there looking at what I'm doing as well. I want to document the entire build, and make videos about the build, and show people what I'm doing. That's kind of the whole purpose, is to document this build for you guys, and to make some awesome content. There's many ways to support this build. Um, as I said earlier, you can become a Patreon. Some people have already become Patreons. Um, you can donate. You can just watch the videos. That's one way of supporting me and that's pretty easy to do. If you guys really enjoyed these videos, just watch the videos. You guys can comment and you guys can also give me advice. That's the number one thing I said earlier is I need advice and I want 
to really involve you guys in this build. Also, I want to work with brands and companies. I want them. To, I want to work with them and really support their project that they're willing to support me in this project. So there's a lot of things that are going to be coming up in my in the near future, and I want to really prepare you guys and let you guys know what's going on. And I am going to give. Um, a little more access to the uh, behind the scenes on my Patreon page. So if you guys want to see a little more behind the scenes in the next build, um, go to my Patreon page and become a member there. You can guys, you guys can get behind the scenes content for just two dollars a month. So I don't think that is, um, you know, too much. But if you guys really want to take it the next step, become a Patreon. But I don't want to just talk about how to support me. I want to talk about to come and what am I going to be doing in the near future. I do have some big plans and some of the plans I can't share with you guys quite yet because I haven't had them down written on paper yet. Some of these are just in my head and some of them are just in the works right now. So I really wish I could tell you guys some of these plans I have but I can't tell you them just yet. But you guys will find out very soon. if I could talk about the subject for hours and hours and there's a lot to tell you guys and I'm just having a hard time um, finding the stuff to tell you guys that I can tell you guys right now just so you know there's a lot that's coming up in the near future this summer so if guys need you guys need to stay tuned for this summer when I plan on building my second tiny home the main thing I want you guys to get out of this video is that I am building my second tiny home and I want this to be um, as much of a build for me as it is a build for you and I want to involve you guys in every part and every step I make in this process. So I hope you guys really enjoyed this video and I can't wait. I really I say this all the time, but I cannot wait for the future videos that are gonna be coming up this summer about my next tiny home. So thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. By the way, look at this lighting. Quite a difference, isn't there? Wow. <laughs>